Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video, I'm gonna be recreating this look right here. I'm not sure how I'm gonna call it, but I guess like you know, daytime makeup look plus eyeliner tricks. <laughs> I guess that's how I'm gonna call it. And I'm just gonna be um, creating this look with you guys it's very daytime it's very like whatever you want to do with your life and if you guys don't know how to create this um if you if you guys don't know how to do eyeliner i'm gonna film the whole thing so you guys can see what i do see you there hello guys for this part of the video i'm gonna do a voiceover um because i forgot to talk yeah random and this is the l'oreal infallible pro matte foundation in the shade fresh beige or 107 i believe and this is a mattifying foundation i really liked it and it was like the first foundation i ever bought at the drugstore and i'm gonna put it on the back of my hand first just like a few pumps of that and then apply it to my face with a damp sponge in dabbing motions Here I'm just using another layer of foundation just to cover up my blemishes because as you can see I have quite a few and the redness in my face. Now I'm going to use the Wet n Wild um, highlighting and concealing pen which I said that I really liked on my made favorites video. If you haven't watched that already you guys should go and check it out and I'm going to put it right underneath. Right and then um, conceal any dark circles because I don't sleep. And for powder, I'm going to use the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Plus Poreless in the shade Natural Beige. Because it's the only powder I use. <laughs> I'm going to set my under eyes first. And then the rest of my face with my damp um, sponge. The next thing I'm going to do is fill in my eyebrows and I'm going to use the e.l.f. brow pencil. For some reason this camera is not focusing but I'm still going to link it down below if you guys are interested in purchasing it. And I'm going to use this pulley side first just to um, kind of frame them a little bit. And then I'm gonna use the other end, which is the actual pencil. I'm gonna use it to fill them in. So I kind of give them the shape first. And then I fill them in. Very natural looking. Why is the light changing for every single shot? That's weird. Anyway. There we go. Again, I'm going to brush them. So they look more natural. 
here you go and yeah I should do I think let's move on to the eyes today I'm gonna do a quick eyeliner and you know something daytime eyeliner that's probably how I'm gonna call this video I'm not sure do a close-up and I'm gonna use I'm using the elf eyeliner this one's really cheap and I really like the really thin wand and I am gonna start from here the trick to do eyeliner is to not breathe okay And this is how you do it. And then the other eye. Let's try and make it the same. <laughs> I'm doing a really thin line. I still have eyelash glue on my eye. It looks pretty similar let me tell you guys you're never gonna get your eyeliner to look the same forget about that just forget about that and let's try it a little bit before we apply mascara because it's gonna be horrible so let's apply a bronzer and the one I'm gonna use is the NYX the, the new NYX smooth skin bronzer why did I say NYX? NYC, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna swirl this around and then put it right here to give my face some healthy warmth because they don't look as flat as the foundation makes us look. That's not very human like, right? So that's why we use bronze. bronzer to give it that human warmth <laughs> and then on the sides of my nose uh, and then my tang, you know, that double tang no? yes and now I'm gonna be using the Maybelline the falsies and this is in the color black is black this is my favorite mascara full time. I actually have to buy a new one. But I'm gonna use this one. Because this is what I have right now. Oh my god. I know eyeliner can be super intimidating, but practice makes perfect after you do it a few times you're gonna get the hang of it and you're gonna do it good i usually look up when you look up it prevents the lashes from touching your lid i know i have a lot of discoloration on my lids don't judge me okay don't don't judge me I don't really like to pack my lids with product because then they're gonna get super oily throughout the day. <laughs> For blush, I'm gonna use the um, Wet n Wild color icon on Palace Pink. And as I said before, I really like this blush. It, it's a recent discovery of mine. And it was like $2, so yeah. <laughs> For highlight, I'm gonna use the One and Wild High Mega Glow Highlight in Precious Petals. You guys know I love this highlight. Uh, I'm gonna spray my highlighting brush from Elf with some of the One and Wild Photo Focus Setting Spray, so that the highlight really shows up. 
in the skin. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. And the bridge on my nose. Then the rest on my face because why the fuck now? Yes. <laughs> yes. And finally I'm just gonna spray um my whole face with the wet and wild setting spray that I mentioned before. And we're gonna put on some lipstick because why not? What is that? You guys see this? Was that the spray? That's so weird. I'm gonna use first lip liner. This one is from NYC and it's just a brown lip liner. It does not have a name, so yeah. And I'm just gonna outline my lips. I'm not gonna lie, this is not very like light on lipstick, but did I say lip lipstick? I meant I meant lip liner. I like to do this because my lips look a lot more bigger and defined when I outline them. Oh my god, I'm gonna use this the Revlon Ooh Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color in the shade Seduction. This was my favorite lipstick back last summer and I'm bringing it back because I really like the color and I like the formula of this lipsticks a lot. They're wonderful. And that's it for today's look. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me some comments down below if you have any suggestions for me if you have any comments and I'm gonna make sure to answer you and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys on my next video bye